Starting with Bloxy2, your shoppers now have the ability to easily compare one or more products while they're checking out your web store. This makes picking the perfect product a breeze by quickly seeing what each of the compared ones has to offer. Setting things up is just a few clicks away, as the system is super simple to work with. The Compare View module is available for all of our Bloxy Pro subscribers on the Professional or Agency package, as it is part of the Shop Extra extension. The first place to go to is the WordPress dashboard. Then under the Bloxy menu, click the Extensions tab. Identify the Shop Extra extension and make sure it is turned on. Look for the Compare View module and turn that on as well. Now let's navigate to the Theme Customizer to check out what options are available for use. We will first need a way to trigger our comparison table. For that, we offer a handy header element that can be added to any of the header rows, including the mobile header. Click on the header tab in the customizer, then drag the compare element on any of the available spaces. Diving deeper into its look and feel options, you can see that we offer a selection of gorgeous icons to get started with, as well as the ability to upload your very own SVG icon. There are also icon size controls, a batch that counts the number of compared products, and an option to turn on the element's text label. Now that we've got that out of the way, we can check out the main configuration options for the module. To get to these options, let's back out to the main customizer view and identify the WooCommerce general pane, then choose Compare. Here you can specify how the Compare view table opens up. There are choices to open it in a neatly modal pop-up view or redirect users to a custom created page in case you want to add additional information. You can also select what product information fields are available in the comparison table. For example, the general field showcases information such as the product's title, featured image, and price. There are also options for additional fields, such as the product's description, attributes, rating, and so on. Please note that depending on what other options you might have activated, you may see a different amount of available product information fields to configure. You also may want to note that each information field has its own specific set of options where applicable, such as the general field having image controls. Last but not least is the compare bar option, which when turned on, it pops up at the bottom of the screen showing your shoppers what products they have in the comparison queue. We'll check how everything looks like on the front end after configuring our options. There's only one more or actually two things that we have to configure in order to finalize the setup. A way to add products to the comparison table. For product archives, we offer a little button that sits neatly in the additional actions part of the product card. To turn the compare button on for product archives, navigate to the product archives pane of the customizer, choose card options, and check out the additional actions section at the bottom. And for single product pages, there's also a button that can be turned on. Navigate to the single product pane of the customizer, choose product elements and identify the additional actions layer. The little eye icon controls the visibility of each button. Okay, okay, we are ready to check out the front end to see the feature in action. Save your changes at this time and exit the customizer. Looking at the main products archive, you notice the new compare button in the actions part of the product card. Add a few more products to the comparison table. We notice here two things. The header comparison indicator has a little badge that informs the user about the number of products added to the comparison table, while the compare bar at the bottom shows a visual representation of what those may be. There's even a little X icon that can help you clear this out quickly. Before we open the comparison table, let's add one more product to it via its single product page. And of course, the button is present there as well. We are now ready to open the comparison table. Depending on what options you have configured, it can be either open from the header button or the main compare bar at the bottom. And there you go. A beautiful modal pop-up window opens up with the products that we have added to the comparison table. Information is presented in a concise and informative way, letting your shoppers make quick decisions. You can see big product pictures, a quick way to add products to the cart, product descriptions, and even product attributes and availability information. And that is pretty neat, right? 
Enhancing your customer's experience always go a long way, and this is another way to increase your retention and conversion rates. Comparing multiple products couldn't be more streamlined now. If you wish to learn more about what Bloxy2 has to offer, continue on onto our website or click on one of our other videos to keep watching.